This pro tip video will demonstrate a knot pass on a lower through a clutch using the dog and tails method. Stop lowering when the knot is 18 inches or half a meter from the clutch. Lock off the clutch and the knotted rope. Tie a figure eight on a bite in the middle of a 15 foot or just under a five meter length of eight millimeter cord. Attach that to a two foot webbing loop or a press it cord. Attach the end of the loop to the anchor. Extend the loop and the 8mm cord in front of the clutch and begin crisscrossing the two cords on the rope. It's important there be a minimum of 10 crisscrosses and that's countered from the top of the rope. Secure the ends of the two cords with a square knot. Then we tighten the dog and tails by milking it towards the load, generally at least three times. Then recheck the square knot to assure that it's still tight. We're going to then unlock the clutch and lower the load onto the dog and tails. Once the dog and tails has taken the load, now we can remove the knotted rope from the clutch and then we can rig the rope so that the knot is past the clutch. Make sure the clutch side plate is fully closed and then lock the clutch. Grip the dog and tails from the load end and slowly push it back towards the anchor until the rope begins to slide through very slowly. Once the clutch is loaded, we can untie and remove the dog and tails from the rope. Now unlock the clutch and the lowering operation can continue with both ropes.